Good morning. Oh no, it's evening. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> when I was when I was teaching training, the my line manager at the time said to me, "Don't ever call the class guys." Like you can't say good morning guys or let's get into our maths groups guys. You just can't ever call them guys. So every time she used to observe me, she used to count how many times I'd say the word guys and, uh, and then basically bollock me afterwards for using it so many times. So gradually I got out of the habit and I said, what, what do I call them? You can't just say children. Like, I don't want to call them children. Um, so she said, well, why don't you call them ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Anyway, the last video we published was a, a hobby craft haul. Jen did it, and it was all about dinosaurs. And, uh, and loads of people, we've had so much comments on it, so thank you very much for all your feedback. Someone said, um, it'd be really good to know some of the activities that we do. So we thought we'd start off this video sharing one of the activities that we did with some of the stuff from Hobbycraft all along dinosaurs. So this is Ted being a paleontologist. Do you want to be a paleontologist today? Yes. Do you want to find some bones? Yes, do you love dinosaurs? Yeah. It's the Ferguson's. Now we get asked to share a lot of different products, like a lot, um, which we're so grateful for, which is amazing. Um, but obviously we say no to quite a lot 
just because we don't want to be like product this, product that, product this. However, when I was offered this printer from HP, there was no way I could say no because <laughs> Literally, Jen has been on and on and on at me for the last year saying, we need a new printer, you've got to get a new printer. Um, she wants to print out some photos. Um, we need, all the time, we need it for Louis' homework. And we have to go around to my dad's house and print it out at his house. It's a right pain in the neck. Jen's out, so I can talk as loudly as I want without offending her ears. Um, Jen's out, and I, and I thought I'd be romantic. So Jen is always, she's like, always on at me, saying that all our photos are always out of date and she wants to up, update them and all this kind of stuff. We never get them printed. Anyway, um, I'm going to choose like some of her favourites, print them all out and then surprise them, surprise her with them, um, which I think is quite romantic. Hopefully I'll get some brownie points. And it's quite, it's quite good because I've, this, pin, this printer is like an HP smart printer. And I use the app. Now, the, and the beauty of it is that I've got a subscription to the HP Instant Ink subscription. So basically, that I've got like six months, and they're going to send ink cartridges when I run out, <laughs> which is brilliant. And that means I can print as many as I want for Jen. I think sometimes people like wonder what we do during the day. <laughs> this is what I do: try and please Jen. <laughs> that's, that's like my only goal in life. Oh man, I've got a head rush. Oh, I'm mega dizzy. Uh, just showing 22 uh, photos um, to print. I'm gonna let, let them go through, and then I'm gonna surprise Jen with a whole host of wonderful photos. Yay! Off. <laughs> That's so good. Do it again. Do your fun. Bye. Ted, that's right. Ted's been doing phonics. He's been learning our phonics. Do your name? Ted. Ted. Yay! You're so clever. M mummy. That's M for mummy. Good boy. Can you do M a M mum? M a a a a a m a t a t a m. Ted, nearly. It's a. It's M M a M mum. Can you do that? Uh, uh, mum. Good boy, yes, you're so clever. Who taught you that? Amy. Amy did. Who helped you with it as well? Did mummy? My mummy. Your mummy. Can you do a, do a t, e, d again? T, e, d. Ted, you're so clever. What about d, a, d, dad? D, e, d, dad. Ah, that hurt. Do it without the bowl. Oh, do a d a d dad without the bowl. D a d dad. Ah! D o g dog. D o d dog. Yay! Teddy, well done. Yes, we found a marble. Yes. That means marble run is next on the agenda. So Jen's popped out to do some swimming to, to go and watch our niece do a swimming race. Um, we are relaxing. Catch. Is that really necessary? Uh, and um, and and then when Jen gets back, I'm going to give her the photos that I printed yesterday. Any more phonics before we go? Uh, do, uh, oh, that was nearly a good one. Do t uh, d Teddy. <laughs> you know all of them. Your cousins. Yeah, so finally, babe, we have this printer that we can now print photos. Oh, <laughs> so, so your walls can be replaced as you wish. Hmm. Oh, look. We're sleepy. Peepo. Oh! 
Daddy looks nice there. Oh, Daddy looks yeah. fat there. That's nice. Oh! Mummy see? and Daddy having a... Wait. A, a treat. Kiss. A treat. Having a kiss. <laughs> it was a treat. <laughs> Cheeky. <laughs> Thumbs up, look. Look at that one. Cheeky boy. Hold on. Careful. <laughs> oh, that looks cold. Oh, what's that? Snow. That's good, isn't it? Now they're not just on Mummy's phone like they've been for the past three years. Let me take this. <laughs> Feel her take eyes burning out, the hole in me. Yeah, well, we'll do it later because we're going to go out for them in it, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, I want to put these all in here. Oh, they don't yeah. all fit. One at a time. But we can put them all in different frames. I want to put all in. <laughs> Say all on the wall. All, all on the wall. All on the wall. <laughs> all on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. There, can you say good morning, everyone? Good morning, everyone. <laughs> that was lovely. Can you say where you're going? Where are we going? No. <laughs> no, you say where you're going. Where we're all going. No, you say where where you're where are you going this morning? Big school, yeah! We're just dropping Ted off to big school. <laughs> that was fun. Give me a kiss, that was fun. Big one? We've got a big one? A big one? <laughs> More? No. <laughs> so we're going, we're just dropping Ted off at big school. And then I've got the dentist. Uh, and then Jen's got the dentist uh, and then we're going to go for a nice walk this afternoon so not a very nice morning quite a nice afternoon um, can you say I hope you have a nice day can you say a bit louder I hope you have a nice day woken up in a very lovely mood even though he didn't sleep very well <laughs> um anyway right i better go because i'm dropping off oh you're getting heavy in your old age ted yeah. are you heavy boy yeah. are you heavy boy yeah. how heavy <laughs> what are you doing that heavy. that heavy yeah good job daddy's strong now if i told you that i haven't been to the dentist in about three years would you be horrified because <laughs> um i haven't my teeth have been fine. I did have a, I did go, actually no, that's a lie, I did go to the emergency dentist on Easter day, about two years ago, because I um, had an infective, infected wisdom tooth. <laughs> a bit too much information going on here. Eh? Dentist now, but then uh, I want to get some new plates and bowls because this morning I was eating my cereal out of a plastic Ikea bowl. Not okay. What the hell is that? <laughs> out for a walk and um, and realized it's freezing so Jen it's Jen skins coming up and Ted wants to go home and get warm and cozy on the sofa so we're gonna do a really quick walk help me babe But we found some deer, so we're going to quickly feed the, some deer some nuts and then jump in the car and go back home and get warm on the sofa. That's the plan. Ah! <laughs> we haven't got a lead for the dog. Yeah, well we have. Yeah. <laughs> Turns out we can't now feed... Where's the lead for the dog? The deer. <laughs> Where is the lead for the dog? At home. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can't feed the deer because Patch decided to chase them and now they've run away look <laughs> they are in the distance <laughs> look there's Jen in the distance <laughs> say mummy come back mummy come back 
<laughs> so uh, that was even shorter than we thought. Jen's not very happy. Are you ready? What are we doing? Hiding. Where are we hiding from? From mummy. This is this is a nice way to end the day. Playing hide hide out under the under the <laughs> the unobvious <laughs> blanket in the middle of the <laughs> in the in the middle of the <laughs> oh I'm a bit naked here. In the middle of the uh, living room floor. I tell you that these games the kids play, hide from mummy under a blanket. I mean, she'll see she'll see the blanket. Actually she might not, she's fairly gullible. It's good old Jen. Oh, sorry about that. Is she coming? Is she coming? Is she coming? Oh! Oh, I bit me! Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Bert bit me! Oh! He actually bit my tummy! He can't do that! That's, that is not the game! Did that land on your head? Are you alright? What, land on his head? No, did the camera land on your head? Yeah. Are you alright? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah! <laughs> That's why we have kids, isn't it? So we can do silly stuff. Daddy, open your mouth. Ah! What can you say? We haven't. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Patch is back. Right, we need to wait for Mummy to come home. We need to wait for Mummy to come home. <laughs> She's kicking. Oh, is that your boo? <laughs> Dinner time in the Ferguson's household. I've finished Lewis. Have you? No. Still looks like you've got some chicken wrap left. Jen. Oh. If someone gave you five grand to eat a bit of chicken right no. now, mm. would you do it? Mm. Five grand. Mm. Would you? I've just swallowed. I've held my nose and swallowed it half. One grand. Yeah, because that's a holiday. Five hundred quid. Yeah, because that's a holiday to Centre Pops. <laughs> I'd hold my nose and I'd imagine it's when I take Mommy. all seven of my vitamins at the same time. Two fifty. Daddy. Yeah, I'm coming. Two fifty. Would you would you want something for two fifty? Yes. Yep. Yeah. I'd want something. You'd want something for a tenner, Jen. Yeah. Yeah, but I could buy him that myself, so I wouldn't need to do it. 100 quid? Yeah, that'd probably be a limit then. 100 quid? No, I'm going to go and get 100 quid cash right now. But 100 pounds I could take... Daddy. If we take me I could take up for the day. out yeah. for the day. Yeah, you could. So for 100 Ted pounds, would you want a bit of chicken? Land, it? Yes, if I could swallow it whole, yeah. Can you swallow it whole? Yes. Can you, would, you, would you just do it for free? No, obviously not. I'm a vegan for if, a reason. If you it it's just my vegan reasons become less morally, you know, if, if, if it can help the boys. <laughs> boys before my own morals, basically. <laughs>